Hello everyone, this is U Smart Tech, and today I'm going to demo Smart Apps Creator SSE. I'm going to go through some main features of SSE and hope you will like it. So, SSE is a software that features uh, interactivity and the way it interacts with the users. So uh, first we can choose the device that we, we, we want our project to uh, display. And I'm going to insert an object here. And I'm going to apply an animation to the dog. So here we have CISO, and you can see right away how it presents. And now I'm going to choose advanced animation, which means I can uh, customize my own root of the animation. So I'm going to check here, play animation when browsing, and we can click preview to see what happened. And now I'm going to show you uh, other features, which is inter interaction, and we go to the interaction tab, and we click the dog, and uh, we can choose how the object interact with uh, the other object that we I'm going to apply. So and then I want to insert another picture here. So I can set like this. Uh, when the animation end. the dog height and press add and when the animation end the turtle appear so I'm going to go back to turtle and choose hide object when browsing so it goes like this So I'm going to give uh, the turtle other order. If the turtle are dragged into a hotspot, so I, I can click here, so the turtle gonna be uh, draggable. And so I'm going to insert a hotspot here. And before a hotspot, I'm going to insert a button. So I'm going to set, uh, when I bring the turtle, go back to home, uh, the counter will uh, scored. So I need a hotspot here, and the hotspot here is for turtle. And I need a counter. So and I'm going to set that. Uh, 
when the turtle uh, move into the hotspot, the counter will get one digit. So let's see. And next, I'm going to introduce the Smart Apps Creator Output function. Uh, click the Smart button here, and then click Output. Uh, Smart Apps Creator can output your apps uh, into Xcode source file, APK file, or EXE. We start from iOS. Click iOS and Submit. Then you will get a zip file. The zip file here can uh, bring to Mac, and then you can publish your apps to Apple Store. And then uh, this is uh, exe file. Uh, the difference between emulator style and desktop style uh, lies in their display screen. Emulator style will let your display screen look like uh, your pad or your phone, which you choose from the start of your project. And then desktop style. We'll let your apps Displayed on computer, when displayed on computer, looks like the normal window. And then finally, the uh, APK file. There are a few things you need to pay attention to. Uh, when you uh, fill the program name blank, you need to start your program name by com this is a must and then you can play you can type whichever you like and if you in the future if you if you want to update your apps then you just need to keep your program name the same and change version code and then when you publish your apps to google play if you only change your version code, your users will detect that and update it too, instead of downloading a new apps. Then you will get an APK file. You can uh, bring this APK file to your flash drive of your pad or phone, or you can publish the APK file to Google Play and make your apps be published. The file is here. And thank you for your watching. This is a brief introduction of Smart Apps Creator. Hope you will like it. See you next time.